All right, and we're recording. Hey gang, Andy here. Welcome to my September 2018 update video for, you guessed it, September 2018. Woo. So yeah, as always with these monthly update videos, I'm gonna go over some personal life stuff as well as youtube -y stuff. So let's just jump right into it. And the first thing I wanna talk about is the very slight change in scenery. Um, I usually, when I do these monthly update videos, I'm sitting here at the corner of my bed because you got the painting up there, you got my closet door. Usually I take those towels down so you're not looking at them all the time. I got my fan over there, keeping things cool and stuff like that. But as you can see, this spot isn't very friendly to uh, the old spectacles. So uh, that's why I usually take them off. So I decided to do something a little different this month because um, that's gonna be the theme of this video actually, is uh, changing things up, doing something different. And uh, I've been doing a lot of thinking as it involves my YouTube channel and just seeing the progression of it over the years and even just recently this year. Um, definitely got to thank you guys for all of the support to this channel. We have well over 4,000 subscribers right now, which is just mind-blowing to me. <laughs> and uh, I want to thank you guys for all the support, especially considering how inconsistent I've been and not only uploading stuff but just like what I upload and I'm looking to to fix that moving forward with my channel and that's where we come to the big announcements of what I'm gonna be doing with uh, my YouTube channel moving forward and so I've decided that starting this month September of 2018 I'm gonna be moving all of my older videos as well as videos that just aren't relevant to me anymore to an archive channel and that's going to be the Andy Sun Archive. Um, if you'd like go ahead and subscribe to that channel. Um, it's up in my sidebar on my main channel page and I'm also going to have a link in the description. I'm also going to pin something in the comments as well and uh, the idea behind that is that I like my old videos. I'm very proud of you know the huge archive of videos that I've made over the years but the fact of the matter is you know people change over the years and people's interests and tastes and stuff change and you know it's one thing to look back at the past but it's another thing to live there and I feel that you know the past should stay the past you know and since I got out of the military in 2015 I've been feeling very adrift very lost in what I want to do on YouTube and I've definitely been feeling very good about uh, doing video editing for other channels um, that's been giving me a lot of personal satisfaction but I've also felt like I've lost the plot as far as what my own channel should be about and what I should do with my own channel moving forward and I've decided to move my old content as well as stuff that just isn't really relevant to me anymore to the archive channel so that way you guys can still watch it and um, look through it be like you know oh, that's where Andy was back in 2012 or you know 2015 or something like that and uh, you know you can see the progression that I had you know in making like my very first videos back in 2006 which really were like compilations from my friends uh, doing karate and stuff like that you know I would get the uh, the video from like a video CD I don't know if those are even a thing anymore but uh, we wanted to just see like a couple little clips, little highlights and stuff, you know, like my one friend, Ben, kicking this dude in the face. Or like, you know, my friend Cody just like one punching this dude and just knocking him out. Um, but we didn't want to have to leaf through the entire video to do it. So I just went and cut up that little clip and put it up on YouTube, which was really new at the time. YouTube was released. I guess officially released back in November 2005, but um, I didn't start making stuff until you know 2006. But even then, that was very 
inconsistent. You know, I just put up videos every once in a while. It wasn't until, well, actually, September 2nd, 2008, when I made my very first video using my own camera. Because uh, before I was using my friend's camera to do stuff. And uh, decided to get my own camera. The very first camera was Sanyo Zacti CG6. Uh, it was used off of eBay with a stripped tripod mount so I couldn't, you know, screw it on to a tripod to hold it up steady. So I had to find uh, creative solutions to keep the camera upright. And it was one of those pistol grip type cameras that were very popular back in the day. So you couldn't just like set it up like you could like a traditional camcorder or whatever. So I'd usually just like hook it into cups and things like that, keep it upright. And uh, from there, man, went all the way around the world, vlogging my experiences in the United States Navy from 2010, 2015, got out, you know, had some rough periods here and there. Uh, but I've been documenting my whole life since uh, 2008 on a fairly consistent basis. And it's been a hell of a journey so far. Um, I always use, you know, March 1st, 2006 as like my first, you know, YouTube milestone because that's when I signed up for my first account. Um, but I didn't start making stuff until September 2nd, 2008, at least consistently making stuff. So that's where it really started for me, you know, as, as a creator, more than just, you know, a passive fan just watching stuff. And so, you know, this this move with the Andy-san Archive, very important to me, you know, because it helps establish, it helps establish my legacy on the platform, but it also allows me to, to do more and not be weighed down by the stuff that I used to do and places I used to go on YouTube. So, you know, you gotta shed some skin to, uh, to continue in your pursuit of growth. And, you know, another part of that, you know, in the pursuit of growth is uh, I'm gonna be moving all of my military content over to my Andy Talks Navy YouTube channel as well. Now, I've done this before with, uh, with limited success, and then with the uh, the recent changes to the YouTube uh, partnership program, I decided to move everything back to my original channel. But, you know, I know this makes me sound really wishy-washy, flippy-floppy, whatever you want to call it, uh, but I feel very confident in moving forward with, with these changes. You know, moving all my Navy stuff to a Navy channel, my old archive stuff to an archive channel and then just keeping it fresh on this channel with stuff that's relevant to my current interests you know putting up new videos and then you know slowly cycling them into the archive as you know I get more stuff so that way you don't have to wade through like literally thousands of videos of mine just to any of the good stuff and also you know I'm not being overshadowed by my older videos as well so that's you know the main point of why I'm moving a lot of my videos is you know so that way I can continue to grow and continue to make stuff that's that's relevant to me now and still respect the past and still respect what I've done before but you know, put it in its own separate category. If that makes any sense. You know, for the, as far as the main channel here goes, um, as far as stuff you can expect, obviously video editing is gonna be a huge one. Um, I have a whole bunch of ideas for different types of content that I'm experimenting with. And with moving a lot of my older content to the archive channel, it's gonna give me more room to to grow and to experiment, to try new things, you know, maybe a podcast, maybe doing like those story time animation stuff, you know, those are some ideas I've been throwing around just to see if, uh, if I'd be any good at them and stuff like that, because I'm always about trying something new, and I think that's what's kept me on YouTube for this amount of time, is just trying something new, and it doesn't have to be something drastically new. It could be something 
as simple as adding transitions, you know, tweaking the audio a little bit, or even just slightly moving where you normally sit for these update videos, you know, just trying something, even if it's just a slight change, just always, always changing. Aside from the youtube -y stuff, delving more into the personal life stuff, um, you know, I just, I haven't really been feeling all that well uh, mentally. And I think that's just because of the frustrations I had for my YouTube channel. You know, it's kind of hard to, to go out there and like blame other people for why I'm why I'm miserable. Because really, it's it all comes down to me. You know, my own happiness is predicated upon me. You know, <laughs> nobody else is responsible for my own happiness. So I think overall, like the person I'm the most mad at for all this is, is me and that's that's hard to deal with man because you know if, if I was able to just blame it on other people you know I can just offload all those problems onto them but you know really they're <laughs> they're not the root cause of me being unhappy and even you know if I did blame them for all my problems it would just be a temporary fix because then you know, I would get another problem that's completely irrelevant to what they what they're doing, and you know, how am I going to blame them then, right? <laughs> I would just be delusional if I did that. So, you know, I just I just got to work on myself, and I've just been feeling like I just need to escape. I just need to go somewhere, to figure my shit out. Because, you know, you can't run away from yourself, but you just need to, you know, center, meditate, exercise, I don't know. Um, so I'm hoping that these, these changes with YouTube, as well as other life changes, um, work out for the best. But in any event, guys, that's all I gotta say for, uh, for this update video. I know it's kind of on the long side when it comes to these. I've been trying to keep them under 10 minutes and maybe with a little bit of fancy editing I might be able to, but I doubt it. So uh, apologies for the long length and kind of the rambliness of it all. Um, I've just been feeling very, very nervous, but also excited about rolling out these changes to my YouTube channel. Cause I honestly feel like it's uh, it's been a long time coming and it's been something that's been weighing on me for a while. Um, as any of my Facebook friends can attest to, just all the different rants and stuff that I've gone on about what I should do for my YouTube channel. So, hoping that these channel, these changes help out. And in any event, guys, that said, this is Andy Son uh, for now. And as always, we'll see you next time. Catch you later, guys. Bye. Oh,